If you think your exam is more important than Michael, you better start living. Michael is your priority. Do you understand me? Yes, ma'am. Do you understand me? Yes, auntie. Good. Where is the baby's car? Madam, I don't play with baby car. I should say good day inside. Are you stupid? What are you talking about? Where is Maureen? Oh, madam. Since morning, when Maureen come out, she never come back. Who? Uh, come back from... Come back from where? Oh, madam, to drop Michael for school. From school, she go go her own school. 
Then, madam, she go come, come back, pick my care, maybe hold up, she go do the way for hold up, then talk. she go move. You know, say, madam, she's supposed to talk. follow Atirari when she come back. When she follow Atirari, madam, she go turn that roundabout. All those problems, maybe she see they followed her God, place. It's not happening. Say, it's So I should work How I go even play with my car? Uh, uh, car? She they, they give me the car. What's wrong? Baby. What's the matter? Calm down. Baby, Michael, Maureen, I can't find them. The school, they're not even picking up my house. Okay, wait, wait, calm oh. down, calm down. You're not making any oh. sense. Oh. What is it? Oh. 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 Hello? Hello? Oh. Yes. Is my son in school? Is my son still in school? Yes. This is Mrs. Ajibade. Is my son Tunde Michael Ajibade in school? Where is Michael? What are you saying, Mrs. Morgan? What are you saying? What is it? Okay. Okay. Are you trying to say that my cousin Maureen did not bring my son Tunde Michael Ajibade today to school? What, what, what's happening? Oh, baby, baby, come on, come on. Hey, 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 hey. Listen, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Baby, no, 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 no. Baby, stand. Baby, call your friend. Hold on, hold on. Call your friend, call your friend. Baby, call your dad. Okay, hold on, baby. Relax, relax. Hold on, baby. Relax, relax. Oh my God. She didn't take him to school today. What's happening? I don't know. Have you checked her room already? Have you checked her room? Oh my. In the bathroom? There's nobody here. Seems like she, she packed or something. No, let me make that call. Good evening, Sam. Sam, I can't find my son. My son, his nanny and one of my cars, they're not in my compound, they're missing. Today, she was supposed to take him to school and then proceed to her own school, but I spoke to the proprietors of his school and she said he wasn't brought in today. She goes to Unilag. Commissioner, she, she's not really the nanny, she's my wife's cousin. She's been living with us for like 10 years and we just enrolled her in one of the, the, the part-time uh, programs. Okay, all right, thank you. Bye bye. Yes, hello. Yes, hello, Auntie. Is Maureen in your house? 
I mean, is she, is she, is she at home? Oh, God. Okay. Okay, did she say she was going to anywhere? I mean, did she even say she was going to? I mean, she, did she say she was going somewhere? Oh. Okay. 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 The commissioner sent us. Oh, yes, sir. Do, do come in. Come Thank in. you. Thank you. This way. Thank you. And, uh, Good evening, ma'am. Yes. Have a seat, sir. Thank you. Usually, my cousin who stays with us in the same house, plays as my son's nanny, takes him to school every morning, and then process for her lectures. Then 4 p.m. she goes back to school to pick him up, bring him to the house and stay with him till I come back from work, say like 5 p.m. When I drove back to the house this evening, when I came back from work, I noticed that my baby's car was not outside, which is very unusual. And I've been trying to call her phone. It's not responding. It's not even connecting. Uh, the nanny is Maureen, your cousin. Yes. <laughs> Please. Come on, this is not a time to be crying, all right? Michael needs us to be strong right now. Okay. God is going to bring him back to us, okay? Okay. Crying as if he's already dead. Dead? No, I'm just saying. It's all right. Have you tried to contact your son's school? Yes. I, I spoke to the proprietress myself, and <laughs> she confirmed that he wasn't taking the to school today. Yes, Inspector coming. Oh, okay. Oh, the car has been recovered, and the two suspects apprehended. Oh, good, good, good. Yes, yes. Uh, how about the case of the missing persons? Yes, yes, yes. The commissioner's case. Okay. Yes, yes. I'm, I'm actually at the Ajibade's residence at the moment. Um, mm. um, yes. I will um, send you some information as soon as I need. Okay. <laughs> it's all right. That was the dispatch officer. Um, he just confirmed to me that there were no accidents in the area, so we are ruling out that possibility. So this is your son. Um, how old is he? He's three plus. He's three years, two weeks, and four days. Okay. Um, what's his skin color? Light skin. Light skin, like his father? Yes. Okay. Mm. Uh, what is the color of his hair? Blackish brown. Brown. It's brown, baby. It's brown. Brown. Okay. Brown is brown? It's brown, detective. Brown. Brown. Okay. It is brown. Brown. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Um, this is your cousin, the nanny. How old is she? 23. 23. 23. And, um, what's her height? Huh? Height. Average, tall, short. She's short. Short. Yes. She's average. She's short. Maybe she's average. For a lady, she's average height. She is short. So average. Average. Short. Average, sir. Short. She's short. Average. Okay. And, um... <laughs> so.
So, mm -hmm. what kind of a person is she? I mean, your cousin. Do you know the kind of friends she kept? <laughs> I've, not, I've not really seen her with, with anyone, so it's hard for me to say. But I know she's very passionate about education, that's all I know. <sighs> and you did mention that she goes to school also. Yes. Which school? Unilag. She does part time in Unilag. Oh, University of Lagos. Okay. Yes. One second. What kind of a mother are you? Tell me. Huh? This is all your fault. Your fault. A career woman indeed. After all the money and the time spent and God finally answered the prayers and gave us a son, my only first grandson. Just look at you. Any reasonable woman will give up all her time, everything to make sure she devotes her time to take care of this child. But no, not you. With your stupid and so-called career. Calm down. Woman. <sighs> what is this? This is not the time to, to apportion blame. That. That's Emeka. Detective Emeka. He's the one the commissioner sent ahead, but he himself is on his way. Well done, officer. Thank you, sir. So, um, any leads? Any clues? Uh, no clues, sir. But I'm sincerely hoping that this is a case of kidnap for ransom. Why do you say so? Well, uh, considering the status of the child in question, it could be some unscrupulous individuals trying to extort money from the family. In which case, the child and the nanny will be safe. And if not? Uh, Otumba, we don't want to imagine the worst. Uh, what is the worst? <laughs> it could be a case of um, random abduction. Hey. In which case, the motive is usually not money. But, but like I said, we hope for the best. <sighs> but if it is for ransom, shouldn't they have called? I mean, they should have called. Well, sir, there could be a couple of reasons why they have not called yet. For instance, they might be trying to secure their locations. And if they are truly professionals, they want to make the wait long. So that when they finally call, the target will be more than willing to cooperate. Uh, we will um, get back to the station now. Uh, first thing in the money, we will call the telephone company and um, they will furnish us with the call log of the nanny. We might be able to pick up some leads from there. Hmm. Uh, I was thinking, maybe we can post something on social network, I mean, right away. I uh, would not advise that for now. It is still too early. Because uh, we don't know who we're dealing with yet. Mm -hmm. And um, it might piece off the kidnappers. We really don't know what they can do at this point. Uh, I, I would like to have the telephone number of the nanny, if you don't mind. <laughs> zero, eight, zero. Okay, thank you. And um, you must have a recent photograph of your son, and maybe that of the nanny. Yes. Please. May we have some copies, okay. please?
Officer, um, I can't seem to find any um, hard copy, but I think I have some pictures in my iPad on my, my phone. Uh, oh, I think I... This is when he was two years old. And then this is like his very recent picture. Uh, this is recent and he was two here. Yes, he was two here. Uh, he pretty looks same to me. Much. Alright, this will do. Alright, uh, good night, sir. Good night, everybody. Um, Detective. Um, are you just going to leave like that? Will you not put some officers around to guard us for tonight? No, Mr. Tunde, you are not in any danger. We can't see any danger here. But my son is in danger. My son is in danger and I cannot do anything about it. We'll find your son. Okay. <laughs> Calm down. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Detective. Good night. Good night. You have to calm down, my daughter. The good Lord will bring back my grandson. Today we have to get going. Be strong and to hold your wife together. I'm sure my grandson will be back. Let's go. I'm not going anywhere. How can I go back to my bed and sleep while my grandson is out there in the hands of strangers? And how does your city here and cooking the video help? I'm going to stay here all night and talk to my God. This is God that answered my prayer. I know he will come into this situation. He's out too. Today, talk to your mother. Mom, you have to go with Daddy. Michael will be fine. Oh yeah, it is
baby. Your mom is right. It's my fault. I should have been here for him. I should have protected him. Don't talk like that. Maybe. Maybe I failed you. No, you did not. I failed him. No, you did not. Stop it. I am a failure. Stop it. It's not true. You're not a failure, all right? Okay, it's okay. No, it's not. Maybe it's okay. It's not okay. It's not okay. Son. Stop, stop doing this. Stop it. Where's my son? It will be okay. Where is he? Let me get you something to drink. Right? I'll get you something to drink. Where's my son? from the detective tomorrow. You just have to be strong for Michael. That's what he will want. All right? Yeah. Try not to break down. Okay. Sure, Michael will come back. Yes, I'm sure he will come back. It's all right. Drink a little more. Drink. <laughs> it's okay. I'm sure Michael will come back. Well, yes, I... I'm sure the detective... They should be able to work something out. <laughs> Baby, come on, stop it. Stop it, all right? It's okay. You need to slow down. You want to drink a little more? Okay, that's enough. It's all right. You feel better? It's all right. It's okay. Yeah. Dizzy. Well, uh, he, would, 
you've been screaming a lot, you've been crying, so you have a headache, you'll be fine, okay? You're dehydrated, everything will be fine. Mm. All right. Mm. You'll be all right, mm. okay? Let me take you to the room. Can you stand up? Take your time. Okay. Come on, baby, you gotta keep your eyes open, see the bed. I want you to go to the bed. All right? Watch your step. Okay, sit down. Lie down. Go. Sorry. Ah. Oh. It's okay. The number you dialed is switched off. Please try again later. The number you dialed is... <sighs> Hello? Are you alone? Maureen, is that you? Where are you? Well, pretty much. Good. Where are you? Where is Michael? Michael is with me. And where we are is really not necessary. Wait, is, is this some kind of a joke? Maureen, I need you to come back with Michael immediately. Whatever it is, we can work it out. You see understand what is going on here. This is how this will go down if you really ever want to set your eyes on Michael. Please listen. Listen very closely because I will say this only okay. once. Okay, I'm listening. Let me make it very clear to you. As I speak with you right now, Michael and I have crossed two borders. And if you don't listen up and do exactly as I say, we will cross the next border. And if I cross the next border, you will never see Michael again. So what do you want me to do? You will pay me 50 million naira for damages. 50 million naira? For what damages? That's too much money to ask for. Okay, 20 million. Deal or no deal? <sighs> okay, fine. I'll get you the money. And I'm sure you can have a good life in any part of this world, but I'm pleading with you. Can you just leave Michael out of this? Please? I will tell you where and how to drop the money, but... Hey, hey, I said I will give you the money, okay? If at any time I hear or read from anywhere that I have anything to do with Michael's disappearance, you will never set your eyes on your son again. Okay. I understand. How can I reach you? You can't. She thinks she's smart.
Baby, you up? Do you feel better? My baby. Don't see my baby. Oh, baby, not again this morning, please. Not again. And our son will come back to us. He'll be fine. All right? You just need to calm down. You can calm down. Where's my phone? Oh, my phone is off. Calm down. And then please, let's just go to the police. Please. Baby, can you let the police do their job? They need some time to investigate. Time? Time until my son is killed? Don't stop saying that! Hey, I'm just trying to say, don't talk like that. Nothing's going to happen to our son. Be positive, okay? I can't! <laughs> Did you get the email? Is her picture clear enough? Yes. So how far are you willing to go with this? Look, just find her and get my son back. And what about the girl? I really don't know. I don't know, man. Listen, I want my son back. Do whatever it takes. Bye. Wow. Me, me, I don't understand again. No. Eh? Where, where this, where this morning girl carry this speaking go? Ha! See, eh? You don't think where are they look that girl with one kind of eye? Can you call me here, Nka? What is the problem with this one? Oga go enter inside moto. He go there, I go open gate. He no go go, he go enter inside house. Come on. Now wow. Is it done? Is what done? Oh, um, sorry, I thought it was somebody else. Maureen, is my son okay? Is Michael fine? <laughs> I take it you haven't decided on whether you will be keeping your own side of the bargain. There is a better way we can do this. We can work this out. I mean, ask for how much I can pay you. I can give you houses. I can even give you part of my company's shares. Whatever it is, I just want my son back, okay? Look, I didn't call to have any further discussion on my terms with you. You know what to do. I understand that. But there is a better way we can do this. Please. Time is running out. Maureen, it, it doesn't have to be this way. Mr. Ajibadi, please, you. Yeah. I, I was having a big business call. The poster for the missing person is actually here. Okay. So I'll just go pick them up. Perfect. Um, remember to call the commissioner. Right. Okay. Be safe. Hello? You cut me off? No, I didn't cut the line. The line went off. It's a network. I heard Cynthia. Cynthia wasn't here. It's, it's, it's the TV. Clearly, you must think I'm dumb. Well, you have one week. One week Listen. if you ever want to see your Maureen, son again. Maureen, how do I know my son is fine? Can you put him on the line so I can speak to him? Hello? Baby. 
Maybe. Mm. There's something you should know. Are you okay? What are you talking about? Is this about Michael? It's all my fault. It was Maureen who took Michael away. Maureen? Took Michael away? Why? She took Michael to get revenge. Revenge? Revenge on me? Why, why would she do that? I mean, I had an affair with Maureen. That, that, that little rat. She, she put us through all this that we are going through. She made us go through all this. You didn't hear what I said. I said, I... I had an affair with Maureen. Baby, baby, are you okay? I mean, I guess, are you, are you okay? I guess maybe you need a drink or have you been drinking? Okay, okay baby. I guess the whole stress of this ordeal is making you delusional. She wants me to marry her. And obviously I can't do that. Yeah, I can't do that to you. Did you think about all of this? Did you think about this before you put us through? Before you started sleeping with her? And you? To you! She wants me to <laughs> tell the whole world about it. And publish it in dailies and in gossip blogs and pay her 20 million dollars. Otherwise, I we will not see Michael again. You know what? If anything happens to my son, you and your demon could not even go for it. We have me to continue. Do you want Come, you, you and your niece, you and your niece, you collect it, you collect it, you collect it, stop it, what is it, stop, you collect it, you collect it, you collect it, what is it, what is it, can you slow down, can you calm down, I need my son, I need my son, stop it, stop it, I need my son, I want to see my son, can you go upstairs, I want to see my son, I want to see my son, can you go upstairs, please. Can you go upstairs? Auntie, I'm so sorry. But what's this issue of son? I don't understand. Michael is missing. Michael since yeah. when? A few days back. And that is why Cynthia is pissed. Because Maureen called. 
Maureen, my Maureen. Yes, she called. What, what has she got to do with she it? She wants ransom to release no, Michael. What? Yes, a ransom, which means she kidnapped Michael. No. Yes, and that is why Cynthia no, is no, angry. No. There's a mistake somewhere. Well, I don't think so because Maureen called. But we, we will fix it. We, we will have to find when out. When did she call? Where is she? I don't know. I don't know where she is. She called on the phone that she wants uh, money in order to release Michael. Auntie, I just think... How, how, how sure are you about that? Well, I spoke to her on the phone. All I'm saying is, let me try and calm Cynthia down. You just go home and I'll take care of this. Yeah, but really, I mean... Auntie, this is, not a good, this is not the best time to talk. I will take care of it. No, but seriously, wait, wait how, when... Auntie, what? it's fine. I'm sure there is a mix-up oh, okay. somewhere. I'm sure. I'm right. very, very sure there's a mix-up somewhere. Fine, but I'll, I'll, I'll keep you informed. Me. I'll call you on the phone. Okay, okay. Hello. What did Cynthia just do? What did she just do? Oh, I, I can assure you, I wasn't privy to it, honestly. I thought Michael meant the world to you. Now I see that he is not that important. Maureen, I'm so sorry. Whatever she did, I'm sorry. Your darling wife has just made things worse for you and your son. Wait, ho hold on. Uh... Maureen, we, we don't have to do this. Please, don't, don't do this. Hello? Enjoy to the max and spoil yourself in every way possible. <laughs> yeah, I know. I wish I was there too. Mm-hmm. I'm fine. I've eaten. Uh, you know, sometimes I just don't want to bother her. She says she's got exams. So what I do, I go to the restaurant or I go to my parents' house. Yeah? Okay, I will. Love you. Bye. Maureen, you okay? I was reading and then I stepped off. Whoa. Okay. I can see that. <laughs> Don't you think you should be going to bed? Careful, watch your steps. Good night. Like, come on. <laughs> Why is it always like that? <laughs> ah. <laughs> okay. You still shy? Oh my gosh. <laughs> now you making me shy. <laughs> All right. Bye. I like it. Nice, nice, nice. <laughs> come on. Come, come over here. Come on. Have a seat. <laughs> you, you shy, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Why do you make me feel so grown? <laughs> mm. 
<laughs> you funny, you funny. Okay, try on the rest. Yeah, no. Okay, it's fine. Come over here. Come on. Nothing to worry about. There you go. I'm going to take care of you. a woman no all I need is time a moment that is mine while I'm incomplete And you couldn't tell me. You watched me accuse and battle Chief Williams about this. Still, you didn't say anything. So, what do we do now? Do we tell the police about this? And drag the family name in the mud? None of this would have happened if you had done what you should do as a wife and a mother. So you still think this is my fault? Yes, I do. I think so. Enough. I don't want to hear another word from any one of you. I don't want to hear oh anything. Oh my God, my I just saw my children. I just saw my I just saw my Sit. Today. That's Detective Collins. You're welcome, sir. Right. From the Commissioner's office. Okay. I'm now in charge of the case. Oh, fantastic. Any news? Well, now we have a suspect. Confirmation that she took your son and her motive. Well, my men and I will track her down and ensure that your child is released without being any ransom. Hey, do you have any idea where she is? Well, Definitely she hasn't left the country because she doesn't have enough resources to go that far. And that is why she's desperate about the money. Right. But we assume that she's not working alone. Detective, please, just, just do anything. I mean, just do everything you can to bring back my son. We are doing just that, ma'am. We are doing just that. Just let us know if she contacts you again. Okay. Sure, how we are. Yes, how we are. I have a question for you, madam. What was your relationship with your cousin? Um. Auntie, I'm back. After how many hours? So just to go and get a few things for the house at the market behind the house. Took you forever. Anyway, just go to the kitchen and talk. Yeah. Hey! Come, 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 come here. And where did you get all this? 
Oh, you're putting on. I bought them. I want to believe you are not stealing my money in this house. No, it's from my pocket money I saved. It better be. Just get out of my face. She, she is my cousin, you know? I know. This is our work now. We have experienced a lot of um, domestic violence recently. Uh, what? Do you remember any anything that may have made her take your child away? <sighs> Time to go to school. Oh God. Um, come back here. Keep him down. And why is his shirt rumpled? I ironed it this morning. Ever since I wore him, he's been clean. It's even dirty. I washed it. I just he's been clean ever since. Are you stupid? This is all you do these days. Excuses. Honey, I think we need to let this girl go. She is just useless these days. Well, if you think it's prudent to let her go, then let her go. Get out of my room. Get out of my room! None that I can remember. Not, not okay, anything. okay, that's all right. Yeah. That will be all for now. But I assure you that we are we are working on it. Yes. We are working very hard, and investigations are on. Okay. Right. Thank you very much, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you. All right. We appreciate Take it. Take yeah. All right. Oga, okay, oga. Okay. Shansa. Young man. Oga. Okay. What is your name? My names are God's Power, Moses, Chukujeku, Odinkemere. Moses? Yes. Okay. This is the way they write my name for your book. Eh? I'll be well, well. You see, okay. you don't tell where I won't join this police force. Okay. You see the security work? Be professional. Forget that. They, you see, Oga, okay. I need us. I need two of us to join hands together. If you recruit me, we can investigate this matter before actually, you know. I'm actually, I want to ask you some questions. Eh, no problem. <laughs> ask me, I go answer you. You were the last person to have seen Maureen before she left with the child. You are there. Was there anything unusual about her? Well, everything usual. Everything usual. No, nothing. Eh, see, Oga. Maureen. You see, madam, madam teach Maureen how to drive so that he go to carry my care, they go to school every morning. You see, okay? he go drop my care, she go go her own school. Now her duty, she do them every morning. So, everything usual. Mm. And she didn't say anything to you either? <laughs> say something to me. That one. That one, they talk to me now. She didn't feel like a big girl. See, Oga, she if you say I never reach that kind of person where go they do. See, Oga, me. She don't reach the kind of girls where I follow now. That, that small girl. Oga, I be slaughter. <laughs> okay. okay. Thank you. Eh? Oga, I remember something. What? Oga, early this morning, hmm? when I the parable, the try check security alert for this compound. I see Ma Maureen. She they make call. Yes, I remember. Okay, this call. She just they make call. They make call. They make call. They make call. She don't stop. Okay, I go check the other side. If they bomb, then what I said for backyard. If 
they catch anybody. Come out. She still they make the call. Okay, she just they make call, they go, just the call. She did? Ah, I'm That's a security expert. I did she make call. Okay. Thank you. Huh? Okay. Okay. What about my name for the police? Uh, the I'll keep that in mind. Huh? Hey. See, Oga, okay, put my name for your security. Listen, Oga, okay, if you recruit me, Zambisa is in trouble. We are invading Zambisa. Huh? Oga, okay, yeah. Look at this man. Huh? After the whole information, you can. You come back here. You see the problem with people? They can't even appreciate detectives like me. Moses. Hello, Detective. Oh, you have her? At the station? I'm on my way. I'm on my way. I'm on my way. Thank you. Thank you very much. They called me that, that they had the suspect when there wasn't her. And you had to bite me? What the hell is all this? Goodness. Hello? Maureen? How do you know it's me? Listen, I'm done with all the games, okay? I have your money. I'm willing and ready to pay the money like now. Just tell me where, when, and how. Okay, you know what? I'm feeling generous today. So forget about the newspaper and the blogs. Just tell okay. your wife about it. It's not a problem. Me you you wanted me to prove to my wife that I have told her about it? Well, talk to her, she's right here. Baby, can you talk to her? I am not screaming her. It's part of the deal. Hello? Well, she doesn't want to talk to you, it's fine. But I'm going to prove my point. <laughs> Baby, I had an affair with Maureen. Go on. And she, she was pregnant for me for four months. And I had her aborted. And, uh, and that is why she's angry with me. She, wants, she wanted me to marry her. And I said, I can't do that to you. So, yeah, I, I said it now. You okay? I've, I've told my wife. You didn't have to drag my son, my innocent son, in, in this, all right? I have your money. Just, I'm going to pay it. I'm giving my son back. I'm tired. Good. I will tell you how, where, and when. Hello? Hello? <laughs> Baby, I'm sorry. Oh. I'm sorry. I can't do this anymore. I'm, I said I'm sorry. Hey, please. I'm gonna pay again. I'm sorry.
Oh, Eva. God. Michael! Hey! Hey! Michael! Michael! Hey! Okay! Madam! Okay! Michael! Oh, oh, you want to say hello to Gampa? Come, come, come. Oh, more pamu pamu. Diki, diki. Oh, glory, Oh, more value for. Anyway, I, I must say this. Yes, we are indeed thrilled that they brought our son. Save and on us. But you. You remain a disappointment to me. I am ashamed of you. I am still thinking of uh, what to do about this. Otumba, no, 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 no. Don't do this. Otumba, please. Don't do this. I told you, he's your only son. You cannot cut off your big toe because uh, you had it bumped or yeah, against his thumb. Eh? Please, yeah. forgive him. Please. Hmm? Please. It's all right. Uh, Dad. Yes. Ah. Yes. Anywhere you like. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Baby, where are you going? What's happening? Where? You didn't tell me you were going to travel. Where are you going with Michael? I am taking my son to where he will grow up, sir. Because I do not know what your next lover would do. Oh, no. No, no, no. You, you, you're not going anywhere with Michael. Baby, I told you I was sorry. I said this wasn't going to happen again. I made it clear. I told you I was sorry and I promised. I am doing this for my son. Do you understand me? You're not going anywhere with my Michael. Son, you're going to stay here with me. I said I was please, sorry. Please do not do this. I am doing this for my son. Give him back to me. Baby, I said I was sorry. Please. I am doing this for my son. Can I have him back? No. Please. Baby, please. I said I was sorry. I promised I said I was sorry it wasn't going to happen again. Oh. I made a mistake, all right? Please, let me have him back. Give him back my son. <laughs> Sit down. I told you. Get out of my face. I said I love you and I was don't sorry. Don't talk to me! I don't Mas, need... put my box inside! Baby, I said I was sorry, all right? I promise! Baby, can you just listen to me? Please. Please. I said I was sorry. And I promised it was never going to happen again. If you want me to cry, I can cry and I'm asking for you to forgive me. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. Don't go. Please don't go. I am doing this. For my son. Do you understand this? This is for my son. I said it won't happen again. I made a promise. I said I'm sorry. Get away from me. I'm crying and asking for forgiveness, all right? Get away from me. Just get away from me. 
Baby, I'm sorry. Please. I'm sorry. Don't do this again. I'm sorry. I promise it's not gonna happen again. Baby, I said I'm sorry. Okay. But if you want to go, it's fine. But you might as well run me over because I don't have a life without you and Michael. Yeah, I don't have a life. I'm sorry, baby. But I'm a big, big, my God. 